Well, we're at the Battery Show, and here with me is Marty, and he's from Maxwell Technologies. And I tell you what, a lot of you guys have asked about how come we don't use capacitors and hybrids, you know, because they charge up so fast. Well, guess what? This is a technology that's starting to become something that's real. And Marty, tell us about that. Well, ultracapacitors are relatively new to the marketplace, but uh, Maxwell's probably the leader in the technology, and uh, uh, we've been doing ultracapacitors since early 2000. Uh, the company itself has been in, their, in ex existence since about uh, 1965, starting out as a government contractor. But the ultracapacitor market really took off in late uh, 2004. Got, we got our first patent, and uh, the uniqueness about an ultracapacitor is what we like to call them, but they're commonly called supercapacitors or electric double layer capacitors. They all mean one and the same, but uh, we choose to use ultracapacitors. That's very really cool. And I understand that these have been in use in Europe now for, for quite some time in various different technologies and applications, right? Yes. And tell us a little bit more about that. Yeah, one of our particular automotive application right now is with Peugeot and uh, PSA in Europe. Uh, we're working with our tier one uh, partner, Continental Automotive, who has developed a uh, voltage stabilization system using two 1,200 farad cells uh, in series in, with the 12-volt system, allowing it to basically add a 5-volt boost system to the 12-volt system. So uh, power electronics don't reset during a start-stop event. And right uh, today, we've got over a million vehicles on the road today with our technology. That is fantastic. And you know, we've talked a little bit about this before. Uh, you, you just don't want GPSs and computers to reset during that start event with start-stop uh, start technology. You can see how important that is. So Marty, in a nutshell, tell us a little bit about where you think the future is with Maxwell and the industry in general with ultracapacitors. Well, ultracapacitors really can play very well with the battery technology. Uh, they're electrostatic energy storage devices, which allows the ultracapacitor to operate down to minus 40 degrees C to plus 65 degrees C. And they're very power dense devices, meaning they can be used in very uh, short durations, uh, peak power requirements or backup power requirements for short durations of time. So we can help complement batteries uh, by allowing the ultracapacitor to handle the peak load requirements, taking that load off the batteries and helping them extend life and also potentially reducing the size of the battery needed for the automobile. So the technology is here now, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Well, there you have it. You guys have asked, how come they don't use capacitors? Now they do.